time is it? You know what time it is. It's time to hit that subscribe button. Where is it at? Where is it at? And it's time to find my Instagram, Geekly Amanda, G-E-E-K-L-Y Amanda, same on Twitter. And it's time to get this reaction video started. So y'all, they had this movie coming out. What's it called? Shakara? And it looks like it's based off a true story. It says, what is known the agony of being a refugee in your own country. In 1990, this happened in 1990, they saw the biggest forced migration in independent anywhere, more than four, is it 400,000 or four million? Kashmir, penance had to flee from the Kashmir Valley. And three decades later, most have been unable to return. So they have this movie coming out, true story. I was even reading some of the comments in this, talking about they had like d d a huge genus. A lot of people died on it. Oh, this looks like a powerful movie. I need to know more about this story is number one. So even watching this, and but this is even just the poster reveal, official motion poster, a motion poster. All right, I'm ready to get to see this. Y'all ready to see this with me? Let's go. <laughs> trailer comes out January 7. You know I'm gonna be checking that out. Just right there, that looks, that little bit, 30 seconds worth of stuff what seemed so powerful to me. I got the goosebumps. And this is, and they're doing this exactly 30 years later telling this story. I didn't even know about this story. I can't wait. First of all, the trailer coming out in early January. And then this movie, um, you know I'm gonna have to check this out. I love these movies based off the history and all that stuff. Shakara, is that how you say it? I'm going to go Google some stuff about it now. Because that wh whenever I do, whenever I see a movie about the true life, I want to find out all the research behind it. Because I didn't even, that's what I said, I didn't even know about this. Well, let me know. Let me know your thoughts, comments. If you want to tell me a little bit about the history, you know I'm always appreciative of that. And until next time, y'all.